Welcome back at 746. Do you ever wonder how specific foods you eat affect you? This morning we we're talking about superfoods and how they can lead you to a healthy lifestyle. Joining us is Dr. Michael Murray. He's written more than 30 books about natural approaches to health, including the most recent book, The Magic of Food. Thanks for being here, Dr. Murray. My pleasure, Sally. So food can be magical? It is. Uh, Sir Arthur Clarke, who wrote 2001, A Space Odyssey, has a great quote. He says, any sufficiently advanced technology is indistinguishable from magic. And we're just starting to learn how food works in our body, and it truly is magical. And what we know right now is pretty amazing because food can heal us and food can also make us sick. So we have to make those choices that promote us towards health. So it's about more than just what tastes good to me. <laughs> yes. Okay, so where do we start? What are some secrets a lot of us want to like live longer but also age well? Yeah, I think one of the key things is to, to eat a variety of colorful f uh, fruits and vegetables. Uh, these plant pigments are really important in protecting our cells and uh, reducing inflammation and fighting many of the things that lead to premature aging. So really the color of the food shows that it's going to be good for us in most the, cases? The, like the, I don't want an all white plate? <laughs> Well, even uh, some of the white uh, fruits and vegetables have some benefits, but yeah, different flavonoids and carotenes have different uh, effects on our body, and, and certain tissues concentrate different flavonoids more. So, for example, blueberries, everyone's probably heard about right. the benefits of blueberries. Uh, they are actually concentrated, the, the blue compounds are actually com uh, concentrated in our eyes and uh, in our brain, so they're very good for our brains and eyes. Blueberries often listed as one of those superfoods we hear about. Do you believe in superfoods? I think all foods are, are pretty darn super if, if they're if, if they're natural and whole. Uh, even something as simple as an apple, that old adage, an apple a day mm -hmm. will keep the doctor away, certainly has a lot of merits. Apples really stood out as one of the key foods that help prevent Alzheimer's disease. And uh, gee, you know, we have a tendency to love things that are foreign and u unique and, and a little bit exotic, but uh, even common fruits and vegetables have great uh, medicinal effects. That is good to know because there's always the latest trends as people talk about some fruit or vegetable mm -hmm. or supplement that I can't pronounce, but just an old <laughs> apple is something that we should be having in our diet. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, you know, a good rule of thumb is to have five servings of vegetables a day. A serving is defined as one cup uh, uncooked or one half cup cooked. If you can hit that goal, you're, you're doing a lot of good for yourself. And uh, two servings of fruits a day. That is really what we should be trying to get to. And those numbers aren't picked out of the, the air. Those numbers are based upon a lot of good science so show that when people hit those intakes, they can reduce their risk of all chronic disease, heart disease, cancer, strokes, diabetes, macular degeneration, arthritis, the list goes on and on and on. As we talk about being healthier with food, of course, a lot of people also are thinking about losing weight. Mm -hmm. What about your tips there? <laughs> well, I think uh, w one thing is is to try and, and focus on uh, low calorie, high water content food. So again, if you're, if you're hitting those uh, numbers, five servings of uh, vegetables, two servings of fruit a day, that goes a long way in filling you up. If you fill up more on these lower calorie foods, it can really help. Okay, so many things. Uh, there's good foods out there that are, make it interesting to eat, interesting in your diet. Tell me again about the name of your book. Uh, the Magic of Food. Magic of Food. And for more information, you can head to magicoffoods.com. Thank you for taking the time to be with us, Dr. M Michael Murray. I appreciate it. Thank you, Sally. And go Ramblers. Thank you. Everybody's getting yeah. on the bandwagon. We love it. <laughs>